Hello and welcome to Video Revealed. I'm Colin Smith and this is your place for professional video production techniques. The subject of this reveal, the slip and slide tools in Adobe Premiere Pro. Now there's lots of different trimming tools in the timeline in Premiere Pro, uh, but the slip and slide tools are unique. The slip and slide tools allow you to keep timing the way it is as you move clips around. Let's go have a look. So I've specifically colored some clips down here in the timeline just so we can understand what's going on. Because the slip and slide tools always have to do with the clip that you're editing, which was, is this blue clip, and what's happening on the clips beside it, the red clip and the green clip. So if I move to this area here, you'll see the tail of this clip is the crowd cheering. The head of the next clip is landing on there and then the tail, sorry, the head of the clip, then the tail of the clip is the jump. And then just to make something different, I threw in an archive clip there. So that's the head of the next clip. That's the tail of the previous clip. You're going to get indicators as soon as you click on a clip to edit it with the slip and slide tools. In the program monitor, you'll have four previews. Two of the previews will not move. With the slip tool, the tail of the crowd, the ending clip there, or the ending frame of the crowd, and the beginning uh, frame of the orange jump guy there won't change. What we're doing is we're keeping the in and out points in the timeline. So imagine you've got a clip underneath and you're just moving the film strip back and forth, but all the edits above it are staying in place. Let's go and see if this makes sense. So over on the left hand side, this tool, the slip tool, which is the Y key, Watch what happens when I click and I'm holding the mouse. You can see the top left, there's the tail of the crowd, the top right, the head of the more orangey archive jump. And you can see that I'm not changing the edit point on the timeline, I'm changing where the edit occurs. So I want him to jump just before he jumps now, and now the crowd cheers and he hits the ground. You'll notice the same position down here. So we kept the in and out points and we uh, slipped that the contents around. All right, let's look at the difference now with the slide tool. So with the slide tool, and it'll be the opposite. What was static before will move, what will be moving now um, was static before. So I'll click and hold. Now you'll see the tail end of the crowd is the larger one and you'll see the head of the next clip and the head and tail at the top are not moving. I'm physically sliding the clip left and right. So if I want to move this earlier or later, I can do that. And let me just zoom in a little bit and show you that there's only so far I can go left and right. On the left clip, I, I don't have enough media there. So you can't slip and slide past the media that you have. But you'll notice that the position, as I move this around, you'll see the sliding tool actually moves the position, moves the full position wherever it goes. You'll see the green clip getting bigger or smaller. And the in and out points from there to there are not changing. I'm just moving the physical clip left and right. That is the slide tool. So they're the keyboard shortcuts of Y and U. So slip and slide tools, they have a, a very specific use and it usually has to do with timing when you want the length of a clip to not change or you want the hole that the clip is to not change and the in and out points to be moved around. Um, Experiment with them, see if, if they make sense for you, but uh, sometimes you might find that slip and slide tools will allow you to get your edit done quicker. Well, hopefully you found this informative. If you have, then please click on the subscribe button for video reveal. If you're not already an Adobe Creative Cloud user, then get on over to adobe.com and download your free 30-day trial. Till next time, I'm Colin Smith, and it's my job to get you looking your best. <music>